Hi, I'm Denise Stanley and I'm a marine ecologist specialising in underwater soundscape ecology at Northeast Fisheries Science Centre and Stalwagon Bank National Marine Sanctuary. Underwater uh, organisms use sound for communication. And this is especially important in places like Stalwagon Bank National Marine Sanctuary where it's, it's deep and dark and they, the visual cues are not as readily available. Today we're deploying two sound traps, the small uh, remote recording units, to uh, record over a complete lunar cycle the ambient soundscape at two locations within Stalwagon Bank National Marine Sanctuary. The main things that we're expecting to hear within our sites is the noise produced um, by sonophorous fishes, that is fishes that make sound, um, also invertebrates and the odd passing uh, marine mammal. As well as biological, we'll also get a lot of anthropogenic noise from passing uh, commercial vessels using the, the Boston commercial uh, vessel line. And depending where you are, you'll get a very different uh, makeup of a soundscape because of what's making the sound at, the lo at that location. Marine organisms make a lot of noise underwater and we don't really f understand the full extent of how noise may interfere with these really important communication channels. But we're planning to continue this project to all four seasons of the year for a complete lunar phase. Mm -hmm.